Oh, about ready to pack this stuff in and leave. I've done what I need to do for the night. Just kind of wanted to let that roll for a second because I find it intriguing to be able to get this nighttime video so well. I wonder, though, how well it's going to pick this up. That should be interesting because I've got no clue. Never filmed at nighttime before. So I don't know how it's, you know, how it's going to pick up the fast stuff, the slow stuff. small stuff if I'm going to be filming at night pretty much got to know every last little thing about what it can pick up what it can pick up and it's going to take or pick up the incremental changes that I'm doing right now if it's going to pick up the slight quarter turns or the half turns it's going to pick it while it's going fast to slow slow to fast get the crank motion. See that? I kind of call that the crank motion because it should wheel itself according to the inside outside motion like that. Looks like it's cranking back and forth. flush maneuvers right here and then what I do is I pull up off of it as it's flushing down like that and then I pull up and it pulls it right out of that move okay so things like that to see how well the camera can pick up the maneuvers. instant reactions. And I was sitting there getting right in front of it and waiting for, like, okay, I'm going to wait for this baby to slow down and then I'm going to take it the other direction. No, 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 no. This is magnetism. So with magnetism, everything should be instant. If you know how to stop and start objects, then you should be able to reach right in and start and stop the object. So it shouldn't be something where you have to wait for it to slow down, okay? You should be able to reach right in and flip it. Now it, granted, okay, if you're new to this, or relatively new, I mean, sometimes you could be doing this for like a year and not get a result. That's the truth of it. But I highly doubt that if you were to sit down and put towards the real effort that it would take you a year to get this going. You'd be surprised what intent can do. Now notice how the movements have changed a lot since I first started because all I was doing was doing these incremental tiny little thingies like that, okay? I was going in and just making sure that the little movements were registering. All of this means nothing without being able to do the really tiny things.
stuff is. Bread and butter. It also lets you know that you're connected in well enough to stop and start it at will in tiny increments. Uh-oh. My camera's telling me something. What could it be?